Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. A year ago, I posted a video that Windows 10 version 20H2 was no longer supported as of the 10th of May 2022. Now, just to give you a quick heads up that if you are still using a enterprise or education version of Windows 10, that now a year later, as of the 9th of May 2023, which was yesterday in my region, which as many of you would know by now is when um, we received our Patch Tuesday cumulative updates, that that Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 10 20H2 Enterprise and Education Editions was the last um, update you would be getting for version 20H2 of Windows 10 because as Microsoft has says, it is now reached its end of life and is no longer supported, which means you will no longer be getting any security or quality updates rolling out for Windows 10 20H2 if you are running an enterprise or education version of uh, Windows 10. Now, as Microsoft has announced, and as I have posted on recently, Windows 10 version 22H2, um, which is the current stable release, um, will be the last version of Windows 10. So there are no more versions coming um, to Windows 10 before we get the actual end of life of the Windows 10 operating system as a whole on the 14th of October 2025. And I did post on that and I'll leave a link to that video down below. But Microsoft has uh, mentioned previously um, that as part of the broad deployment phase, and I'm quoting this from their Windows Health dashboard, Microsoft is offering this update, which is version 22H2 of Windows 10, to an expanded set of eligible devices running Windows 10 version 20H2 and later versions. So um, that means that basically what's going to happen now um, is because Windows 10 Enterprise and Education uh, 20H2 uh, systems have reached their end of support, you will most probably be getting the actual um, feature update to Windows 10 version 22H2 now rolling out by default on your Windows update page. And Windows 10 20H2, as many of you may know, rolled out in, I think it was back in October of 2020 and was actually the last actual feature update as a whole that really brought um, a lot of changes and actual new features to Windows 10. Every other update since then has basically been um, using a um, enablement package, which means you get a fast installation experience um, and it installs like any, basically any monthly update and doesn't really bring any um, new front facing features. A lot of the um, actual so-called features are under the hood or behind the scenes features. So if you do upgrade from Windows 10 version 20H2 to Windows 10 version 22H2, um, things are going to look very similar. Um, give or take maybe one or two little tweaks and adjustments, everything's going to look uh, very similar. And then just on another, on another side note, um, if you are still running Windows 10 version 21H2, which was the feature update that rolled out in October, November of 2021, uh, that um, it's going to be reaching its end of support um, next month in, in approximately a month's time on the uh, 13th of June. And the 13th of June, once again, is Patch Tuesday. So that will be the last security, cumulative or quality update that Windows 10 21H2 um, will be getting and, as mentioned, will reach its end of support date on the 13th of June next month, 2023. So this is, once again, as I say, the end of Windows 10 as an operating system. Um, Microsoft now starting to phase things out and now with the so-called end of life of 20H2 as a whole, and um, 21H2 um, reaching its end of life uh, next month. As mentioned, 22H2 will be the final version. So we can see now that Microsoft once again is starting to progressively now phase out Windows 10. And then obviously we move into Windows 11 and a possible Windows 12, which I have posted on. And if you want any more info regarding uh, Windows 12, uh, just do a search on the channel. But if we just head over to um, About Windows, just in case you were unaware, if you want to see what version of Windows 10 you are running, just type Winver into the search. And yeah, you'll see your version. And I'm currently running version 22H2. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.